All right, guys, here's a little pro tip when you're getting your valve body put together. I just got marking fluid on all the bolts so I can see if I torqued them all and I can see if people tamper with it. But anyway, on your four spool switch valve right here, you're going to want to set this gap anywhere from 300 thou to 330 thou. I don't care what shift kit you got, what if it's a 46, 47, 48, you're going to want to set it anywhere from 300 thou to 330 thou. <coughs> so. After you get it all together, you can pop that little spring out. These come in here. Let's see where we're at here. 333. And then you just take your spring. You can feed it right back up on there. Bam. Also, with the Pro Kit, they say to leave the PR screw flush, but I find um, it's not always the case as far as what they're saying the pressure is going to be. So I like to do any from anywhere from two to four turns counterclockwise, and that gets me right where they're telling you it's it's supposed to be. You know, max one eighty five psi. This one I set at three turns. <clears throat> but anyway, that's the finished product. We got our oversized Borg Warner governor pressure solenoid. And then we got our genuine Rostra transducer. And if you have a if you have a newer truck, a one plus, or it's got the uh, the other style sensor, you're gonna want to get this Rostra 50-1606. This is their the newest brand new high pressure transducer this is rated for 500 psi this is like only a few months old it's been out now and you're this get, this is the end all be all for uh the you know the third gear start problem the problem is people will put a shift kit in these valve bodies but then they go to their stock the all black transducers that are just plastic the black factory ones well those cannot handle high pressure valve bodies they rostra had a version of this before that was also white and it was their HD, but it was only good for 200 PSI, and people were still eventually popping them. These are the best thing out right now. These are supposed to be the 100% fix, fix for it. So, <clears throat> just a little tech tip 